the book started as just a short story that I wrote kind of on a whim because I was listening to Nirvana one afternoon. There's really nothing more complicated to it than that. And I wrote the story and my friends, my friends liked it. And a friend of mine who is an editor of a journal decided to uh, publish that original story in her journal. The journal is called Press One. And I started writing more about the characters and I kept asking more questions about them. And I, and I did this for about nine months and ended up with seven or eight stories. And um, I kept calling them my uh, group of linear stories about the same people. And my friend said, eventually, you have to admit that you're writing a novel. And I didn't really want to do that. I felt like once you admit that you're writing a novel, um, you've committed to something. And I didn't know that I wanted to commit to it. But of course, I was doing it all along. Uh, and then eventually, I did commit to it and wrote it all the way through to the finish. Uh, a few of my friends read it. I revised it. Um, that took about nine months to a year of, of revisions. And I was about to start the great agent search, and I had a list of agents that, that I wanted to submit to. I had a list of publishers that I wanted to, uh, to send the book to. And it was actually an event at Arcadia where uh, Lee Bird and Bobby Bird, who are the, um, the owners of Cinco Puntos Press, and Lee Bird is, is an Arcadia, or a Beaver College, I'm sorry, alumna, came to campus. And I went to their event. They were celebrating uh, Beauty is a Verb, which is a anthology of poetry um, by disabled poets or about disability. And they came here to throw a big event. It was a wonderful event. And I happened to meet Lee. And we were talking. And we connected. And I was telling her that I was about to start sending out the manuscript. And she said, send it to me. And I did. And about three months later, other people at Cinco Puntos had read it. And, and they decided that they wanted it. And I couldn't be happier with a publisher like that. I thought that I would have to go to an agent to get a publisher like that. I fortunately skipped the middleman. And we edited it together. And I'm thrilled with the way it came out.